Hey, what's up, everybody? This is Power Glove Pixels and my co-host Spider Empire. So we're back again with episode uh, uh, sixty-eight or sixty-nine. Uh, uh, could be sixty-eight. Yeah, I think sixty-eight. I think. Uh, so this is pretty much part three of the E3. E3. Uh, I think it ended today, right? I think E3 ended. Uh, yesterday, I believe. Yesterday. yesterday, yeah. Yeah. So this is basically an E3 recap. Right, so yeah, it's just a From recap. Friday all the way to I guess to yesterday. Yeah. So um Yeah, I mean what did you think of this E three in general? Did, what, uh, you think this was better than last year's or you better than last year's? No. Cause I don't remember if there was any good announcements, huh? Last year? La- last year there were there were. Yeah. Um this year yes there were. Mm-hmm. But Something felt off. I don't care if um, uh, PlayStation was in here. You know, Sony was in here. Mm-hmm. It just felt different, you know? Yeah, because I, yeah. I went to... Um, I know I go to this store called World 8. I, mm-hmm. I don't know if you heard of it. It's right here on... It's not that far, like six minutes away from my house. And the owner there, he said that he went to E3 this year. And he said that he wasn't that excited for something was missing he also said the same thing like like, yeah, like yeah, something was off this year i don't know uh-huh yeah i told you uh, and i and i think i'm i'm thinking is that all the you know newer systems are being hold back you know for next year yeah and um and probably all the games that were probably were going to be shown this yeah. year but but they're holding back for the new systems, you know, to show them off and with the more powerful system. Right. Yeah. Yeah. That's what I'm thinking. Cause I was kind of shocked. I was like, yeah. hmm. cause wasn't... think about it. Um, a lot of people were predicting that, um, uh, Nintendo was going to show off their, you know, switch XL or yeah. Switch Mini. Yeah. they're still working then, on it, but they haven't. Yeah. 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 But like I said, with, you know, them, you know, people hyping up that, you know, hyping up, you know, yeah. Uh, uh, the Scarlet, you know, mm-hmm. PS5. Mm-hmm. Then finding out that uh, Sony wasn't gonna be there, so that that basically, you know, um, let the you know Microsoft and Nintendo go. Oh, okay. If they're not gonna be here, not gonna show off, you know, the PS5. Why should we show off, you know, Scarlet or the new Switch? You know. Mm-hmm. Yeah. So I think that's also what felt, you know, kind of off. Yeah. Even though Microsoft just came with Thunder and Lightning with the games, you know, yeah, um, Dragoon coming back and Fantasy Star, uh-huh, I Fantasy was Star on a lot of people, have, a lot of YouTubers are like, "Wow, I can't believe that game is coming back to the yeah." Uh-huh. And with Nintendo, fucking Banjo and Kazooie, people, you know, wanted that character for a long ass time since Melee, but couldn't because of you know Microsoft, yeah, and, yeah, and Microsoft, Rare, yeah. yeah. So, you know, that's yeah. what, you know. Mm-hmm. Yeah, it was interesting this year. Very interesting. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Yeah, I don't know. What other games? Did they announce anything else? Uh, anything else? No, it was just pretty much. Probably there were, but um, not a lot of, like, traction to it. You know yeah, what I'm yeah. Um... One thing that got announced uh, uh-huh. Uh-huh. during E3, I'm pretty sure you knew, is the Turbo Graphic 16 Mini. Yeah, yeah. I'm excited mm-hmm. for that one because I always wanted to have a mm-hmm. Turbo Graphic 16. Yeah, and you know, but when that thing comes out, it's gonna get um, emulated. You know, all oh, the like games you are mean be... you mean hacked? Yeah, 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 yeah. for sure. And I'm, that's what I want to yeah. do. That's Just like I'm... the NES yeah, and yeah. the SNES. It's gonna happen with this one. You know that system had a lot of great games, dude. Like it had um Yeah, it did, but it had um, Bonks. Remember that game Bonks with the mm-hmm. big head looking Yeah. Cave. yeah. It, it, there were cool games, but I just need you know how I was blind by Nintendo back then and <laughs> but, Well yeah, they because they can't coming out with games and games and games. Yeah. But the difference was uh, if you remember the damn little cue cards, it's like dude, you felt like you're gonna break that thing in half. <laughs> And you know what's funny? And 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 it uh-huh. came in a CD case. You, you, yeah, like yeah, yeah. It was kind of weird. It's like weird. I remember. I don't know if I ever told you this story, but 
I remember um, growing up, I had a, I don't know if he was a friend or whatever from school. He lent me the the Turbo Graphic 16, mm-hmm. and when I tried it, dude, there was roaches coming from everywhere, and it didn't even work. <laughs> and after that, he disappeared. That kid from school, uh-huh. he, he never showed up again. It was kind of weird. I kept it, and I don't know what happened over the years, but that's so what you lost. You lost the Turbo Graphics. Yeah, I don't know what happened because you know I had moved different you know places uh-huh. here, over the years. Uh-huh. I have no idea. I've never found it again, but. I kept it, and that kid disappeared, and huh. I don't know. I just I wanted to play it, and I just right. kept, I couldn't play it. Re- really retarded. Um. Oh. Uh. So what's what's going on with that arcade one ups? What what have you? Okay, so the new the one up arcade just announced two new arcades. Okay, what are they? The first one is X Men. Oh my God! Yeah, X Men, Mar- uh, Marvel superheroes. Oh, okay. I thought it was X Men Arcade. Yeah, it is. It the, is the, no, no, I mean but... the arcade though, the one with the four oh, players. Oh no, no, no! Yeah, a lot of people wish it was. Oh. But it's Marvel superheroes. Mm-hmm. Uh, Children of the Atom. Okay, that one's good. And Punisher in one. Okay. The arcade, uh, Punisher. And then on the second one that they announced Mm -hmm. is TMNT. Oh, my God. That is awesome. Uh Uh-huh. That's awesome. And um, they're putting the first one and Turtles in Time. Oh, no way. Together in that cabinet. I didn't know that. I knew that the arcade was in there. Yeah. How much are those? Uh, Unfortunately, the the turtle one is going to be $300. Oh. You probably or, could have yeah. one of those right in your room. I think it could fit. No. Isn't it small? Yeah, it's small, but I had to fucking rearrange everything. That'd be cool, huh? Like you just had it right there, like. Oh yeah. <laughs> yeah. Play some arcade Ninja uh-huh. Turtles. Yeah, but um, yeah, three hundred dollars. It's four players, oh, just that's like awesome. the original. Yeah, that's awesome. Mm-hmm. Yeah. yeah, so a lot of people are really excited. The only thing, like I said, they were bum is that they didn't put the uh four-player version of uh, the X-Men game. Yeah. That or one. the Simpsons. Yeah, that, yeah, yeah. But it's also like, you know, you, I believe it's Konami, right? Yeah. Uh, for the X-Men game, the four-player. Is it, is X- it No, 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 it's not X-Men. Okay. Because I have it. I have it on the 360. Uh, the Simpsons is, right? The Sims. Yeah, that one, yeah. Yeah, that one is. Okay, so I'm thinking it's some sort of licensing then. Yeah, the X Men one, I'm not really sure because I have it on the 360 arcade, the uh-huh. uh, arcade version. They released it on uh-huh. there, and I don't know who, who made it. That's a good question. I need to go back and yeah. turn that on because I don't even know. Yeah, because, um, yeah, I've, uh, a lot of people are saying that it's probably licensing. Yeah. Because yeah. the, the Ninja Turtle games are Konami, right? Those are. Yeah. Like, Konami, mm-hmm. but also, as you know, it's with uh, Nickelodeon. Right? right. So they had mm-hmm. to deal with those two companies as well. Okay. Um, but like I said, it's licensing. So maybe in the future we'll get the X-Men four-player arcade mm-hmm. and also the uh, Simpsons four-player arcade. Right. Like, I have those games on the uh, Xbox 360 arcade. Mm-hmm. I have those already. I bought right. them a long time ago when they got released. Yeah. They're cool, though. When it when is it coming out? Did they say a release date on that Ninja Turtles arcade? Uh, I think this year or next year. Okay. Yeah. You know which one I always wanted to get the Street Fighter one. You know the Street Fighter one that came out. Oh yeah yeah yeah. I always wanted to get that, but just never got around to it. It's too expensive and it's hard to get. You know. Mhm. You know. Yeah. Mhm. Yeah. So. Um, yeah, it's pretty cool, dude. Pretty pretty awesome news. Uh oh! Remember the Game Pass Ultimate? Oh yeah. So mm-hmm. it is true. Uh, a lot of YouTubers are actually making videos, right? Uh, of uh, that one dollar special. So if you mm-hmm. got the gold and you upgraded the way you did, you don't pay nothing for the whole entire year, dude. Which is pretty okay. awesome, dude. And some people even bought three years, and then they just bought wow. the, the one dollar one, and it gives them three years, dude. Wow. So they they're saying that that's like what people should do, but that's a lot. Buying three years is about yeah. one 
160, 160, 180, something like that. Around there. So if you buy three years, pay the dollar, and you get three years. For example, on my side, I bought like I think a year already. So mm-hmm. for me, I don't pay until next September. Yeah, yeah until next next September. Yeah. All right. Which is pretty cool. It's pretty cool, dude, because you save a lot of money for now. Yeah, uh, you get all the games for free. Yeah. Okay, uh, the next thing, uh, Destiny's final expansion is going to be Shadow. Mm-hmm. Um, Shadow something before we move into the next generation. Shadow something. I forgot what it's called for Destiny 2. Right. That's going to be the final expansion. And GTA is gonna have one last one too. It's called GTA Casino. I think that's gonna Ooh. be their final. Yeah, it's like supposedly they're gonna open a casino in that world. I don't know. That's their yeah. final one as well for all the people out there. After that, this is gonna be miners and right, it's minor a wrap. Updates. Yeah, and then yeah, and then it's a, there's none no more. That's it. I'm not sure. It's gonna come out this year though. I'm pretty sure like in the next couple of weeks or something or a month. I don't know. Right, right. But then after that. That's it, man. We're coming to an end with all these games. Yeah. Um. What else? What else? What else? Uh. Anything else before we move on to entertainment? Anything else gaming related that you've been watching? Um, what has Max been? Have you been watching Max lately, or has he been um, playing anything, or not really? He was, but I forgot what it was he played oh. yesterday. Okay. That's cool. Mm-hmm. Uh, um, I told you about the collection, right, for Final Fantasy Seven? Yeah, yeah. They're asking well, three hundred. Right? Yeah, three hundred bucks. No, three hundred and thirty. I think. Yeah, that's oh, how much. Three thirty or three fifty? Wait, let me check right now. Hold up, I have the link. It is. It is. I'll tell you. Right Cause uh, Max ordered the one. I know that. Yeah, it's three twenty nine. Oh, three twenty nine. Okay. I'm tempted. I, me personally, dude, I'm I'm a hardcore into Final Fantasy VII, and but I'm yeah, tempted. Really? I haven't decided yet, but uh, end of the but month. The, uh, but the thing is, um, well, that uh, what is it? The uh, the action figure. Well, is it going to be sold by itself by the company? Not mm, not no, not, I um, not so. Sony. I don't mean. Yeah, Sony. no, I don't think so. I I, I never yeah. seen that. Even if it do, but if it does, it's still expensive, dude. You know the bike yeah. before, dude. Just the bike, him on the fucking bike is like, they were asking like four something, dude. Like expensive for that stupid bike, him on the damn. Yeah, bike. but that's eBay. That's eBay. No, no, no. It was on their website. I think. Oh, really? I, wait, let me check something. Now that you just you you just check, said that right now. Check the company. Wait, I'm on their website right now. Let's see. Let's see. Um, Yeah, they do sell the bike alone. Wow. Oh, okay. How much? Three hundred and seventy dollars. You see, I told you. So the bike alone, dude, is expensive. Three hundred and seventy bucks, dude. I'm wow. and for officially from them. So if you think about it, for three thirty, you're getting that special bike, and then you're also getting the game. You're getting the soundtrack, the art book. You're getting all kinds of shit. So I mean, I guess I mean, you're paying a lot for that. No, I don't recommend this for everybody. It's hardcore. You know what I mean? This is like the true hardcore like Final Fantasy. Yeah. You know? Like yeah. me, I love Final Fantasy. So I, I'm willing to do it, but I don't know. I, I'll decide until the end of the month if I pull it off, if I pull the trigger, you know? Yeah, the... they still have it. Yeah, and they still have it, yeah. Because you know there's going to be fucking scalpers going after it. Yeah, and that's just going to be and... over probably like six, eight hundred bucks. No, you know? I'm, I'm thinking one grand. Yeah, it's just going to go way off. Also the cyberpunk one, right? There's a there's also collectors for that as well, I believe. Um, let me see how much is the the cyberpunk one. Uh, you can hear me, right? Yeah, I hear you. Oh, okay. I thought you went. Um, no. Okay, cyberpunk collectors edition is two hundred and fifty bucks on PS4 or. Xbox. Xbox, yeah. So two fifty, and you're getting that special statue. Mm-hmm. Not bad. I mean, not bad. I guess. Not bad. All right, let's move on into entertainment. Um, so in the la- last 
podcast, I don't think we talked about Godzilla. Huh? We didn't really get around to talking. Um, I don't think we did. I don't think no, so. No. So, what are your thoughts on the movie? Did you like it better than the first one? Did you? you were you kind of disappointed with the uh, anything or? Uh, uh, the only thing that I was disappointed in that movie was the uh, a little bit too many uh, close-ups. That was it. Oh, okay. Mm-hmm. But I like the movie. I love that they brought back the old school soundtrack. Mm-hmm. You know, remastered, redone. Um, what is that thing that they're about the ending? You know, I don't know if you heard about their. Teasing. Okay, so what, what? okay, so the ending is basically teasing the the next movie, Godzilla versus King Kong. Okay. So that's what it is. But also, um. The uh, head of Ghidorah, he saved one of the uh, that bad guy that we saw. Right, and that's coming out next year, right? I must assume. No. Uh, yes, next year I think so. Oh, okay. Think. But yeah, um, a lot of people are predicting it's gonna be probably Mecha Ghidorah. Right. The robotic version of uh, three-headed monster. Right. Yeah, so that might be the uh, third film in mm-hmm. Godzilla. Mm-hmm. So, yeah, I'm excited for the Godzilla vs. Kong. Yeah, it should be pretty good. Mm-hmm. Um, yeah, me... Um, uh, I, I can't remember that guy died from the first one. Remember that dude? What was that dude's name from... Yeah, he... Um, the dude uh, from Breaking Bad? The main dude? Yeah, what, yeah Brian Cranston. Yeah, he there did we go. Die. Yeah. He did die. He did die, right? Which, yeah, die. yeah, which is kind of stupid. I hated that they killed him off in the first movie. Yeah, yeah. They should have kept him alive, or you know, like, uh, you know, brought him for the second one. You know, making people think that he died, but it would have been like a holy shit moment if right. he would have came out. Mm-hmm. You know, taking over Monarch. Yeah, it's cool. Like, I like the special effects. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Um, we didn't get to see it on 4D. You know, a lot of no. people don't really watch it in 4D. Like you ask people, like a lot of my friends are like, "Nah, like it's weird." Like, no, no. But say the thing is about 4D uh, movies or 4DX, mm-hmm. however you want to call it. Uh-huh. Um, you have to go see the movie first before you see it on 4DX. Cause yeah, yeah. We we've seen that um, a lot of people didn't enjoy it. They did and they didn't. Yeah, because it was you know, annoying. Because it took them all out of the movie. Yeah, yeah. So, uh, I, if you guys are going to decide to go to see a in, movie in 4DX, watch the movie first. Because I've been looking at other YouTubers and they say the same thing. It, it's cool, but it gets annoying. Like, if you really want to see the movie, like, you really uh-huh. can't. Um, also, my cousin, I don't know if I told you. Um, you know my cousin, right? The one that you met. Yeah. Uh, yeah. He went to go see it and he said that it's good, but that the 4DX kind of, like, ruins the... I mean, it's good for the second run, but not the first run. If you're trying to, like you're saying, no, no, yeah. So that's why, go watch the movie first, then go see it in 4D. Yeah, years. because you're more distracted with the freaking yeah chair moving left and right, and it's like yeah. you're more, <laughs> mm-hmm. more concerned about the fucking chair than that movie. Mm-hmm. And then, um, yeah. So maybe in the future another movie comes out I mean, i'm pretty sure yeah. terminator right i'm pretty sure that's gonna be on 40 yeah yeah i'm uh probably one of the things that kind of sucks is the timing remember i was telling you that it's it's not like they only have like certain times for 40x remember i was telling yeah. you yeah it's yeah, it's weird. Weird. yeah but the thing is is because they have to reset everything they, they have to put in water again yeah yeah uh, so it's, it's um, different uh put um air again into their um yeah. cannons or whatever device that shoots out air yeah making sure that the uh, chairs are working fine mm-hmm. that's the reason it's only one a day yeah it's like it's different it's not like you know like a regular movie where it's like every little you know once it's done the next one comes in you know what i mean like this yeah one, mm-hmm. this one is just more like yeah yeah but i give it in out of a 10 i'll give it a nine a solid yeah. nine. for me it's Same a solid here. nine yeah Same all right. Anything else movie wise? Anything coming up? Anything uh, movies. Uh, Lion King is next month. Mm-hmm. Um, 
they showed off a trailer for the sequel to The Shining. Mm -hmm. It's called um, Doctor Sleep, I believe. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Looks good, the trailer. The next yes. movies I actually I'm interested in watching is The Terminator. You know the one that's coming mm -hmm. out later this year. Yeah. I'm also interested in that uh, Joker movie. What's it called? That new uh, yeah, one. Yeah, Joker. It's called Joker. Oh, that's called Joker. Yeah, that one. Yeah, that mm -hmm. one looks cool. Yeah. Um, anything else coming now? Star Wars, I think at the end of the year. Yeah. Yeah. Towards the end of yeah, the year. Yeah, but that one is like fuck. People watch that shit gets packed. Mm -hmm. For those people, those tickets run out. Apparently, yeah, that's like, um, yeah, so all right, anything else before we wrap it up? Anything we don't want to be missing uh, anything, and then we're gonna be that's like, about it, dude. Yeah, I don't think there's anything else like that. Um, all right, so, um yeah, just let me know. I, I know you, you still haven't downloaded it, right? Because I haven't seen you online on the... No, no, because there was uh, stuff going down here, you know, yeah. fixing and everything. I never had a chance to put the new um, hard, hard drive, drive that you gave yeah. me. Yeah. Or, you know, just finish updating any of the games that mm -hmm. I have. Mm -hmm. so... you, make sure that you installed... Um, you, you did a list, right? Which ones are your, your first ones? Yeah, yeah, I already have them here. Like, the, uh, make sure it's... Crackdown and try to put Sea of Thieves now because of these, you know, these people are going to start playing it. Yeah, these fools are going to start playing it. Uh, sea of Thieves and that one. I think Sea of Thieves could be good if we were like in a group. I think we would be more, you know what I mean? Yeah. We could defend ourselves and it's just us two, you know. That's what I was telling uh, Paul. If we have more people and we, and we find other people in that world, think about it. We'll have more like... Uh, yeah. And I think there's probably like five people that are gonna play it. So besides us, so with us will be what seven people. Yeah. So mm -hmm. I think we'll probably have more, a little bit more fun, I guess, with more people yeah. in there. All right. So I think that's pretty much it, guys, um, for the video. So thanks for watching. This is Power Glove Pixels and my co-host Spider Empire. Till next time, guys. See you next time.